Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel and welcome to the very first cash stuffing for uh, January of 2024. So I'm super excited. This is January week one. We are starting um, something new on my budget. You will guys, you guys will see. Um, but yeah, this is the year we are getting out of debt. I am stopping my spending addiction. We are getting on track with my budget. So yeah, you guys are going to be seeing a couple changes. This year we are going to be adding five videos a week on my channel. Um, I'm going to be doing weekly cash stuffings of my bills, my husband's bills, my what I make in a week as a server video, um, what my husband makes in a week as a server video, and then I'm also doing like my bill condensings and I'm doing um, a debt payoff tracker for both me and my husband. So make sure you guys are subscribed if you are interested in any of that stuff. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be posting Monday through Friday, um, every single week. So that's exciting news. I'm excited about it. Hopefully we can get ourselves on track because the holidays, literally since November, I have been overspending so freaking much. My credit cards are racked up again. I have an addiction. I need to break it. It's a really big problem. So that is going to be the goal of 2024. We are getting out of debt. We are stopping this. I am doing a no buy year or like an extremely low buy year. Um, I'm going to be budgeting for things that I want to buy, like specifically. Uh, I'm not doing any more impulse spending. Um, yeah, so I'm going to be doing my very best to be trying to do a no buy year or very low buy because like... I'm human and I'm probably going to end up buying stuff, but as long as I have it in the budget, then it's okay. But yeah, that is our goal for this year. Hopefully, I feel like 2024 is my year. We're going to get things together. Everything's going to be really good. And yeah, anyways, let's go ahead and get started. So this is from my cash tips from the last week that you guys saw. Um, or maybe it might be the next one that you guys see. I'm not really sure. I think it might be the next one that you see. But yes, this is for January of week one. I have $770. This is all my cash tips. So if you guys don't know, I'm a server. I already, obviously, I already just said that, that I make those videos every week. But yeah, so this is just my cash tips, not my paycheck. My paycheck goes to my personal loan and my um, credit cards, which hopefully, <laughs> hopefully we can get paid off this year. Um, but yeah, I got 200. I'm gonna count that 50 in a minute. Um, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 80, so 480, 490, 500, 550, 560, 70, 80, 90, 600, 610, 620, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 700, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 7, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, and 70. So $770. Okay, so let's get started. The first thing I am doing, oh shoot, I did not empty these out yet. Um, yeah, so I did not empty these yet, so I will have to do that. I'm not gonna write on this one just because it's super full, um, but I'm stuffing $400, so I have two, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84. That felt like it was more. Okay. 1, 2, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84. No, I, I don't know. It feels thick like it's an extra one. I don't know. Okay, so that is going to bring this to a total of... I, it's only um, December 18th as I'm filming this. And so I haven't paid my rent for the month this year. I haven't paid January's rent yet. So um, that will be taken out soon. But I got... One, two, and I, my rent is $1,600 a month. So I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, two thousand, 
20, 40, 60, 80, 21, 20, 25. So 21, 25 towards rent, which is good. I have enough for my rent plus a buffer. Okay. Um, internet. So internet, I do have space. So it is the 18th and I am paying $25. Um, I did get a new Sharpie. This one is fine point, um, I, or a fine tip, fine point tip. I'm not really sure how you say it. Um, I didn't know that when I bought it, so hopefully you guys can see that okay. Um, but yeah, so $25 towards internet. All right. So for internet, I now have a total of 51 20, 40, 50, 55. So 155. All right. Okay, so then next up we have water. And I'm putting in $30 for water. So 20 and 30. Okay, so then that brings us to 51, 20, 40, 50. So 150 towards water, which should be enough for my bill. 150, okay. And then next we have electricity, 12, 18. I'm putting in $50. And that should bring us, I'm gonna just do a 50. That should bring us to... Uh, 1, 2, 3, 350, 70, 90, 4, 10, 4, 30, 4, 50, 4, 70, 4, 90, 5, 10, 5, 20. So $520 towards electricity. Um, my snapshot, 5, 20, on like the app for my electricity bill says that my bill right now is projected to be about $180. So obviously that can change, but that's what it's expected to be right now. So I have plenty for that. Um, the gas for the house is getting another $50 here because it was like $50 a month and last month was like 170 something. So it like jumped up a lot. So now I have to make sure that I'm stuffing plenty in here because it's the winter now and obviously we're gonna be spending more on like heat. Um, but 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 30, and 40. 140 is what I have so far. Hopefully it doesn't ever get more than that 170 because that was a lot. Okay, so next we have phone bill. So this is something I want to figure out this year, um, how to get that lower. I think it's mostly just because we're still paying on the phones. So maybe we can work on that, but that's getting $85 this week. Shoot. Let's do fives, five, 10, or I'm going to save. I'm going to do that. Okay. So you got 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95. That's not right. About 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85. I'm going to recheck that because I feel like I messed up. <clears throat> 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85. Okay, yeah, we're good. Okay, so $85 towards the phone bill. That brings us to our phone bill. Stupid, stupid expensive. Um, I don't know why I did that. Okay. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 80, 2, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 4, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 4, 35. Okay, that's good. So I have enough for the bill and a little bit extra. 435. It's always important to have a buffer in your accounts because you never know as a server what you're going to be bringing home. 12, 18. So I am putting in $10 towards trash. And I'm going to do fives because I'm going to save those tens for something else. Okay, 
So I got 20, or 50, 70, 90, uh, 110, 130, 35, and 40. So 140 towards trash, which is $100. Um, like every three months. And I think I like missed the payment or like I was off or something. So I'm going to wait till it gets taken out again before I um, try to fix that. And I'll just keep the rest as like a buffer. Subscriptions is getting $25. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Um, and I just did a bill condensing and so I took all of that out. So I have a total of 25. Almost forgot to write it down. So 12, 18, I'm putting in 25. And so I have a total of 25 in here. Okay. That's it for that one. Next up, we're doing my high priority sinking funds. Um, and we're only stuffing like two things in this one today. Um, the first one being like medical and dental. 12. 18. I'm putting in $20. 5, 10, 15, 20. And that leaves me with 20, 40, 60, 81, 120, 25, 30, 35, 40. So 140. Okay. And then I have, so gas for my car, I'm not stuffing as well as groceries and household because I do put those on my credit card anyway. Obviously I just said that I wanna get out of credit card debt, but um, yeah, I do put those on my credit card and I feel like it's just easier to put that money directly to my credit card and I didn't have enough to budget for that stuff specifically this month, which sucks, or this week. Uh, just because my bills are so high now. Um, 12, 18. Um, I'm putting in an extra payment to my credit card of only $45 this week, which sucks, but, and it's empty, so it's gonna be a total of $45. But that's all I can do right now. So I got 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45. Okay, so $45 towards that. Alrighty. So that is it for my bills in my sinking fund, well, my high priority sinking funds. So next up, we're doing an uh, envelope that I haven't stuffed in a very long time. So this one is like my holidays kind of binder. Um, I literally don't even have like trackers or like envelopes or anything for these <laughs> because I haven't stuffed them in so long, like over a year probably. Um, so I have Christmas in here. I have Nevaeh's birthday, which is my stepdaughter. I'm not stuffing anything for her birthday because um, she's turning 18. Um, I bought her like a lot of stuff for Christmas, like a lot, way too much. And so I ended up taking a couple things out of that and I'm going to give that to her for her birthday because why not? She doesn't need like 10 billion things at Christmas when her birthday is in a couple months. Her birthday's in March. I know her birthday's in May. Sorry. Uh, my son's birthday's in March. Uh, her birthday's in May. So I'm just going to save that stuff for her until then. And yeah. So then I have Gray's birthday, which is my three-year-old. He will be turning four. So I'm putting in 12 or 18. I'm putting in $10. And that is a total of $10. So this goes with my... Am I doing this right? I don't think I'm doing this right. I think I had it like this. Um, yeah, I need to make trackers for these if I'm going to keep stuffing them. But, yeah. Okay, so um, this goes with my whole trying to get out of debt thing. So if I budget for the kids' birthdays, that will hopefully keep me from overspending. Um, whatever's in here is the only thing that I am allowed to spend. I cannot spend anything else. I can't go overboard crazy on their birthdays. So, um, I'm going to do it like this, actually. Yeah, I made these when I first started my <laughs> cash envelope um, stuffings. Um, next is Liam's birthday. So, that is my six-year-old who will be turning seven in July. Um, <laughs> yeah, I guess the last time I stuffed this was 12 I think that was last year. 
so 12, 18, I'm putting in $10 and it's empty. So I have a total of $10. So hopefully by the time their birthdays come, they have plenty in here. Oh yes, yeah, see, I don't even have my other son in here. So I'm gonna just put it in here. This is Roger's birthday, that's my husband. I'm not stuffing anything for him, but um, 12, 18. $10. Yeah, I'm going to have to redo all of these envelopes. Um, $10, total of $10. This is for my baby Ivan. So he turns one in March. So he, if I do $10 a week, my almost one year old, uh, his birthday comes first. So I'll have a smaller amount than everyone else. My three year old turning four, his birthday's in June. So he'll have a little bit more than the baby, but less than my, th my older son. So I think it kind of works out that way. If I do $10 every single week, um, the later birthday obviously is going to have more money and he's the oldest. So I don't know in my head that makes sense, but it, that is going to be it for today's video. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys next time. Bye. Thank you.